In the past, I built the see-through model rocket engine, burn model rocket engines underwater, under liquid nitrogen, in a vacuum. I even filmed the amateur rockets with the rocket team from UIC, but I've never seen a rocket launch from underwater, filmed in slow motion. This is gonna be interesting. For the very first test, I was gonna use an aquarium, but after thinking about it, I ended up using this round glass cylinder here because I think it's gonna look nice and symmetrical. So we should be able to see the patterns that the thrust creates underwater and in the air. First thing I have to do is build the rocket. All right, here we go. And the idea behind this is just to, uh, you know, make something look cool or interesting because most of the time, looking at this footage, we always learn something. So, all right, let's do it. Oh no. All right, so it looks like uh, the rocket landed right in the tree. That worked out pretty perfect. The parachute even deployed and the rocket's still intact. And the water this time was really clean, look at that. Next thing I'm gonna do is launch the model rocket from completely underwater by carefully modifying an aquarium to stand in the upright position so we can fill it up with water from bottom to top. And launching the rocket from underwater. Too much water pressure. Hopefully this thread's gonna hold it. Oh man. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yeah, it's angled that way now, so it should be good.
Well, that worked. That just about wraps this episode up. This is something I've been wanting to do for a long time. I think it looked pretty cool. Don't forget to check out all the other videos on this channel. Don't forget to subscribe. And most importantly, don't forget to share your opinion below and tell me what you think. And if you have any ideas off of this episode, let me know. Hopefully you enjoy that. See you next time.